Alright guys, Avid is back with something a little bit different for me. It's going to be a my mindset when I'm playing as a centre-back. This is predominantly covering the centre-centre-back in a 3-5-2 formation or any 3-back formation, guys. My thoughts would change slowly if I was playing either one of the outside CBs, but I still think a lot of the um, thought process through... Just defending in general will help you if you're looking to improve. Now, obviously, I'm doing this video because when I done my build video, I had a few ask me if I would do a like a defending tutorial. Now, just a little disclaimer, guys. CB is not my main position. My main position, the position I love to play, is cam. But I really do enjoy centre back when I play well, and when I feel that I'm not getting screwed over by the game. Now that's an easy excuse for if people make mistakes they can blame the game but I know when there's something my pro is doing that I didn't want him to do and vice versa things like that so that's just a little disclaimer boys I don't claim to be a top top centre back I just claim to be a decent centre back who enjoys playing there and just want to pass on my thought process this is not even really a tutorial this is showing you what I'm thinking while playing the game there's a lot of video clips here a lot of um, reference points and they're going to be covering uh, seven key aspects of the game that I've tried to pick out through all the games that we've played this season so far for Lincoln City Esports so the first one's going to be good positioning second one is going to be covering your teammate knowing when to cover the teammate looking to be ready to cover your teammate three is going to be covering the cross goal you're one-on-one -on -one with the striker let the keeper take the near post not many people shoot across goal now but try and position yourself across goal and trust your keeper to take that near post and then obviously as a center back sometimes you've got to spray the ball about you've got to have the composure to get yourselves out of a little bit of pressure and find that switch of play or that release ball and number five is going to be attacking and defending corners. It's hard to find the examples for all of these guys, so you'll have to bear with me. There won't be a lot of footage for um, certain scenarios. And the last two, um, I've not got a lot of footage of these guys. And the main reason is, is because uh, number six, which is get in front. I'll, uh, it's easier to illustrate than it is explain. But get in front means you're all running back to goal. They've got the ball wide. He's ahead of the fullback. You know he's just looking for that R1X, R1 square across the area. You have got to get in front of their striker. And then finally, which is something I don't do very often, it's a emergency situation only, is press the ball. But just before we get into the clips, guys, I'm going to just describe to you some fundamentals of centre-back and rules. If you stick to, you will instantly try to do better. Number one is track runners. Okay, guys, always try to be in front of the nearest attacker to you. Okay, and when I say in front, that means closer to your goal than he is because... You might not recover in time if they play that ball. Because he's ahead of you, he's going to get the lock onto the low driven cross. Okay, And basically, just good positioning and being aware. I do recommend playing a very zoomed out camera angle for centre back. Because I'm not a big fan of switching on the D-pad or the touchpad. I prefer to see my player most of the game if I can. I will admit now... I do get caught ball watching and that's when I rely on my centre backs around me having good communication. So good communication with your full back your full backs or your partner centre backs is key guys. Anyway, let's get into the clips. Well you're in the can spot mate, you shouldn't be in the middle. Big win again. Goes forward, forward, go, 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 go. go, go. Clear, clear. Oh. I did, I put my foot through it just now. Nice. That's it, Callum, just go over one. 
That's a great ball. That's not that. Who's that it? Trying to steer it through. Well played, good defending. Good. Nice, also good to hit him. Let's mark up. Oh, well played. Well played. Well played. Well played. How is it, Liz? How's that? Well played, I've heard. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Come on. 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 The way to win the ball, but I got five markers. Oh, shit. Ah, good. No, shit. Oh, that's not those. Now, that's what I'm talking about. Do you know what I mean? But just, just. He changed direction, and my crew just wanted to catch one of them. Well played, big save, right? Good to... This could bring them level. Hold on. Yeah. Swim back to you, Danny. You can put it back into my feet. You can put it back into. Hold it back. No, no, no. I'm here. Okay. One more. Nice. nice. He's coming off you, Jay. Yeah. Come on! Come on! Well played that. Come on, if you can. Dreadful start to the second half. It's nice. It's nice. Yeah, that's how we want to play this. Come on, again. Brilliant. Oh, sorry. Oh, that wasn't even to you. Sorry, I Good call. Good call. Curtis! Oh, Paddy. Just hold it. Don't do no one at X to it. James? Oh my god! Oh. I played it, he just didn't release it. Nice, well done. Well done. done. It's okay. Right way, right way. It's okay, come on. The yellow, the yellow's a punch face. Thank fuck he got a heavy touch there. Oh, shit, it's me, I'm it? I'm captain, aren't I? Yeah. I've got a five. I was at four. I've got the blue oh, haired one, yeah? Just, just stay in front of your man, man, boys, yeah? There you go. Right, pick him up. I've got this one. I've got this one here. He looked like he had tracksuit problems all first. Lads, just watch if someone peel off to the back post, yeah? Someone follow that run if he does. Going to not lose heart, and he's not done that. Oh, that's good defending. Three, two, one. One. Oh, oh, that's it. Oh, yeah, that's it. One, go. Oh, yeah. Um, Danny, go in the D. Get back that he needs to be. Come me down. Come me down. Yeah. Three, two, one. You've got a big job here, Abbott. Look at the size of him. Oh, that's Get it. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Yeah, I was just waiting for one to open. Got some fucking backs there. It's played, I don't know. Nice chance. Don't 
you've got them there, that's well played, mate. Yeah. Come on. Uh, oh, finished, Jay. DMs get into him. Oh, oh, mate, I'm the fucker. I'm running anywhere. away from him in the middle, to be fair, though. Yeah. Yeah, my God. Come on. Yep. Um. Right, so this. So just to summarise, guys, mm -hmm. thanks for being there. If you are already here and you've got right to the end of this video, this is quite important for me. Obviously, I've put mistakes in there as well. The one where I was switching play and it got cut out, the... My player just didn't play it. I put the done the input and he just didn't play it. I took too long to make my mind up to play it and then took too long powering it up. So I got closed down. So just be aware of that. Um, also, the one where you get in front, the first instance where the guy is just too fast. My player's acceleration's not got me there. So I needed to react just a little bit earlier. Luckily, it was close to the keeper and I would have cut it off if I had to come any further back. But then, obviously... The one where I overcommitted to the near post too much, and because my momentum is taking me towards the near post, which the keeper has already covered, all the striker has to do is cut inside and he's got an open net. If I didn't overcommit to that near post, he wouldn't have cut back, he'd have probably just shot near post. And then finally, the corner tactics as shown, sometimes you would get your reward, you pick up some assists, may pick up some goals, and it's all about arriving at the right time and staying in front of your man guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it helps you let me know if you use any of the tips let me know if you've got any any other ideas that i could use i'm happy to listen to them and just please leave a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you next time